How in God's name? Why would you think David is your father? When I applied to Quantico, the FBI wanted to know my whole life story. You know, and I realized that there was a lot that I didn't know, especially about my dad's side of the family. It's because you were really young when Terrence died. Something was off. Terrence wasn't my real father, and don't disrespect me and try to pretend otherwise. You know, at first I wasn't suspicious, I was just curious. So I did one of those ancestry DNA tests to find out more about where I came from. It came back that I was a quarter English and a quarter Irish, and it wasn't black Irish either. Needless to say, that proved Terrence wasn't my father. So I used FBI resources to find out who was because clearly I couldn't trust you to be straight with me. Eli, Eli, I, I, I thought, I, I was trying to... I was waiting to have this conversation with you face to face. Clearly, I waited too long. My father is dead. And it is because of you that I will never know him. So tell me, Mom. Why the hell did you lie to me all these years? David and I were in love. We were, and, and we were gonna get married. And then, and then things just didn't work out. David was afraid of commitment. And, and so, and so we just moved on. When I left Salem, we were on good terms. And then later he, came to see me while I was in D.C. And I thought, finally, finally, we could be together and make it last. It was just more of the same. And as soon as we got close, he took off. I didn't even know I was pregnant until after he had gone. It must have been awful. No. No, Eli, it was the best thing that ever happened to me. You are my best thing. Do you have any idea how much I love you? No, I don't. Because if you love me as much as you say you do, you would have never kept me from knowing my father. <laughs> I went back and forth about telling David about my pregnancy. And then I thought to myself, I didn't want to do this to my child. Have him feel the way I did, hurt and disappointed and let down and rejected. David couldn't commit, and there is no bigger commitment in the world than to a child. But you didn't even give him a chance. He had already had a chance, and he failed miserably with his son, Scotty. And then Terrence came into my life, and he accepted you as his own. And he was a good father to you, Eli. But he wasn't my father. My whole life, you have lied and lied to me. I knew you weren't in New York all this time. I knew you were here in Salem. You know, but I thought maybe, just maybe, you were trying to find a way to tell the Hortons that I existed. Okay. But obviously, that wasn't the case. You never wanted them to know about me. I just, I just didn't want your heart broken. Well, it is now. Why, why didn't you say something to me sooner? Eli, you never even let on that anything was wrong. I guess I learned how to lie from you, huh? <laughs> I had a right to know the truth. And so did my father and his family. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm 